Good afternoon. I uh, did. I listened to a little bit of the <laughs> Matthew McConaughey <laughs> autobiography. Oh hell oh, yeah, yeah. you were telling me. We came up on like Amazon's. Like I don't know why. I just listened. He to reads it. it himself. It's very funny. You know what? I'll just pull it up. And listen yeah, to let's example. listen to <laughs> it because he transitions to talking about being molested. But like he's like, he got oh, molested. Fuck yeah. you. Like, was How's he so chill? I was one of the I best kids on the soccer team. Sucked by the I coach. Led, I led the league in yellow cards as a goalie. <laughs> when I was thirteen, my uncle fucked me in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's a twist. <laughs> It's a real twist. <laughs> he's like catches you off guard. You're like, what? <laughs> yes, when I was 13 when I years was old, 12. an 18 year old boy held me down and fucked me in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> the new Lincoln Navigator. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that really uh, takes a fuck. takes mm-hmm. a turn. A pussy getting legend, probably. Yeah. Yeah. So the one of the, the, the more chill satisfaction guy, at the time and still. I found a reliable theme. Mm -hmm. So I packed up those journals and took a one-way ticket to solitary confinement in the desert where I began writing what you hear now. An album, a record, a story of my life so far. Mm -hmm. Things I witnessed, dreamed, chased, gave, and received. Truth bombs that interrupted my space and time in ways I could not ignore. Contracts I have made with myself, many of which I live up to, most of which I still pursue. Mm-hmm. These are my sights and scenes, felt and figured out, cools and shamefuls. Graces, what truths, and beauties of the world. I, I, I can't imagine. I can't, I can't and imagine an entire getting away with, getting reading an entire wet, book trying to dance at this the fucking like. Yeah, this is crazy. Yeah. Why is he doing it? It's like bebop. Well, because it might just be the intro. I don't know if it continues like this. It's being jazzy. It's, it's overridden for the sake of like. Experiment called life. Being a guy that, Hopefully, yeah. it's medicine that I takes I just want to get to the part where you just drop signal in the yeah, A spaceship to Mars without needing your pilot's license. Okay. <laughs> it's just celebrities. It sucks, <laughs> a spaceship to Mars without, without needing, needing your... It's what? a love letter to life. It's a penis. Now, speaking of bumper stickers, I have always loved bumper stickers. So much so <laughs> that I've stuck bumper <laughs> to sticker so and made them one you. word. Bumper sticker. What They're lyrics, what? one-liners, quick hitters, unobtrusive personal preferences is this the that guy people he publicly is? express. Of course. Yeah. They're cheap and they're fun. They don't have to be politically correct because... Well, they're just bumper stickers. From the font no. to the fuck color scheme this? to the word or words they say. This sounds like one of those comics that tries to rip off George Carlin. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh, the worst, if they've yeah. got a family or not. If they're free spirits or conformist. Funny or serious. What kind of pets they have. Get what to kind of raped. they like. Yeah. Even what they're I'll just, we'll keep it on in the background. Yeah. Over the last 50 years, I've been collecting my bumper stickers. Some I've seen, some I've heard. But it goes, I swear to God, it just drops right into the... Do you have a time series? No, and it's also, there's no like, ca- it's just you hit the play sample button do. on Amazon. I've included quite mm-hmm. a few of my favorites in this book. All right, get The to sole it. objective is the pursuit of the singular finish with only the arrival in sight. <laughs> this <laughs> is what brings us together. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh my God, my ass fucked. Is that it? Sometimes you got to go back yeah. to go forward. And I don't mean going that's back from, to reminisce or chase that's ghost. That's from the show. I mean, go that's back from, to see where you came from. Where well, what, true yeah, that's what from he's True Detective. That's from True Detective. He's just copying <laughs> True Detective. <laughs> One of the worst written shows ever. <laughs> I remember hey, that, that was a good show. Quite well, a first season. Sold a lot of cars, too. Shut the fuck up. Time the ending was circle. stupid, but that girl's tits so, are awesome. That was how did I get stupid. here? I take it back. That well, I earned stupid. a few scars. Here here we we go. Go. This rodeo of humanity. I've been good at it. I've been not so good at it, and ultimately, I've found some pleasure in all of it. I might take way. another second. Here are some facts about me to help <clears throat> set the table. <sighs> I am the youngest brother of three and the son of parents who are okay. twice divorced and thrice married to each other. Mm-hmm. We grew cool. up saying "I love you" to each other. We meant it. I, oh I got whipped That's into so much my different butt than other putting families. on a Cracker Jack tattoo when I was 10 years old. When I first threatened to run away from home, my parents packed my bags for me. Damn cool. My dad wasn't there the day I was born. He called my mom and said, only thing I have to say is if it's a boy, don't name him Kelly. <laughs> the only thing I ever knew I wanted to be Kelly's in life a good name was a father. For a boy. Mm-hmm. I learned to swim when my mom threw me in the Lano River, and I was either going to float off the rocky waterfall 30 yards downstream no, or make it back to the he's bank. A liar. That's not what <laughs> I made it to the bank. I was always the first one to wear out the knees in my tough skin jeans. I was sucking so much. For dick. two years, I led the under 12 soccer league in red cards as a goalie. Wow. 
When I kept whining about my lone pair of tennis shoes being old and out of fashion, my mom told me, keep griping, and I'll take you to meet the boy with no feet. I was blackmailed into having sex for the first time when I was 15. <laughs> I was certain I was going to hell for the premarital sex. Today, <laughs> well, I'm merely certain that I hope that's not the case. I was He's molested laughing. by a man when I was 18 <laughs> while knocked unconscious in the back of a van. Okay. I've done peyote. Okay. So I like, wait, 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 peyote. Oh, he, he fucking zooms past that so fast. Yeah. No, that, that, I got some pussy and I was raped by a man. He said it's so I, happy. I, I, too. I, I forget. I don't know how I scrubbed the first time. I was like, what's the fucking Matthew McConaughey audio book sounds like? Because I did. I certainly you just didn't got have, there? I certainly didn't have to listen through to all that. You have the power, it, Nick. It started at uh, like the first chapter, but yeah. <laughs> like, like, well, I played crazy. soccer and. My dad was mean and I was molested. A girl tried to fuck me and I mm. said yes. And then she uh, blackmailed him into sex. <laughs> it yeah, was pretty, pretty good. cool. And uh, somebody fucked my ass in a van. When I was 18, <laughs> I was unconscious and molested. <laughs> I've done peyote. <laughs> that was that is thing. one of the funniest things I've ever heard in my life. Yeah, dude. it's very good. That's awesome. I might, I might have to read the thing. I don't know if I could listen to him say it. No, oh, yeah. I, I got. You should you just buy it. The and, full experience. And, and so I'll get the molested. book and we'll do like a Chapo style review. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Of uh, we'll yeah, have Vir- we'll have Virgil on to bring up. So those guys read all of them. Read a book? No, they split it up. I think. Yeah. Oh my god! I was gonna say that'd be horrible. Yeah. yeah. Could you imagine if all three of us had to read one gay ass book? We can't even remember a movie we all already <laughs> saw because we wanted to. Yeah, we make. <laughs> <laughs> that is like, uh, come town reviews independence day i'm like i watched it three times in one day who's the main bitch in that again <laughs> who is the main <laughs> bitch who plays the main bitch uh, isn't vivica 